Now that the foundation for our greenhouse has been completed, it is time to start putting it all together. We bought our greenhouse kit online as it was so much cheaper than having one already made and delivered. We got it for $368 on catch.com.au. The one thing that we will be doing is building a base frame to attach the greenhouse to so that it is stable and won't blow away in a gust of wind. The instructions were far more complicated than they needed to be and they were by far our biggest frustration. Oh my gosh, so we have seriously struggled to put the corners of this greenhouse shade house thing together <laughs> and I guess it just came down to not really being like, built properly so we've had to go in and bend each of the corners into place otherwise the bolts didn't fit. <laughs> started this build, Sven sort of warned me and joked about how this was going to be like putting up one of those old-fashioned tents. Well, he was not wrong and the project sure delivered on that front. frame together. I'm just going to go around it with the impact driver and just tighten everything up a bit because this is the tool that came with it. Going to be level. That's pretty level looking. No, a little bit. It's not fantastic, but 
this plank is much better. It's the back one that's a little bit off. Oh yeah, this one's this one's perfect. We have bought these railway sleepers that have been treated, so they should withhold the weather and pests. We have already measured and cut them to our required lengths. This thing's supposed to be self-tapping. That gap's nothing, this gap's... Yeah, well that gap is the one we're going to have to try and force together. He doesn't even reach. I'll take it. The greenhouse frame had been completed and secured to the sleepers, I went around and just re-raked the cracker dust and filled all the gaps underneath the sleepers to make sure that it was as level as possible. We have purposely left a border around the greenhouse to assist with mowing the lawn and to help with drainage. All right guys, we are finally finished. This took way longer than expected and a lot more work, but we are so happy we did it. I thought I'll just do a quick walk around and show you what it looks like. So it has come with all these windows and insect netting, which is really great. It unfortunately just doesn't have a door at the back, so we will be making our own. But it's pretty hot in here, so definitely we'll need to change this out for shade cloth in the future. Now one of the things we decided to do was remove the middle bar so that we didn't have a trip hazard. So I'm going to spend the rest of the day moving into the greenhouse. Otherwise guys, I think this is where we'll leave you today. Do let us know what you think of our greenhouse and any great recommendations on shelving and storage options because that will be the next thing we'll be looking into. Mm -hmm.